my channel. Um, it occurred to me the other day that I don't actually think you know what my name is. My name's Sophie, by the way. I just, I feel like I haven't actually said that. I mean, if you've looked at my channel, and if you've looked at my Instagram, my TikTok, then you know. But like, I haven't actually said, hey, what's up? But Sophie. <coughs> That's so bad. Okay, anyway, I welcome you to my channel. If you're old, what's up? Hey, <laughs> if you're old, if you if you know, my name's Sophie, and we're gonna talk about unpopular opinions. So again, I got my book, and we're gonna start off with strawberries are disgusting. Absolutely not. I love strawberries. It's just amazing. Like you can't get actually you can get really good fruit, but like they're amazing when they're just like ripe and they're all juicy. And they smell amazing. So I disagree with the first one. Uh, not having to be nice people and sharing your own opinion and being entitled to your own opinion. Yeah, I agree with that. <laughs> I agree with that. That's what I meant to say. I agree with it. I don't think there's anything wrong being entitled to your own opinion and not having to be like, well, I, I don't really agree with myself. I have to agree with you. So yeah, I think that's fine uh christmas whoa christmas season is way more e romantic than valentine's day i i agree with that i don't know i just feel like if it's got snow and then you're like i don't know it's just like so much more romantic i feel because you can take i mean yeah you can take cute photos but like even cuter photos on christmas day well not necessarily christmas day but like the christmas like period season kind of thing so yeah, I agree with that. Next one, pineapple and pizza. I think I've answered this one beforehand. If you, you want to go watch my Q&A, because I did that, and it did pretty well. That's why I'm doing another, like, sit-down one. So, pineapple and pizza. Yeah, I think it goes. I used to eat ham and pineapple on pizza. Don't anymore. Don't eat ham. Um, but yeah, I should... <gasps> I might try pineapple just on pizza. Uh, ju pizza just with pineapple. Um, um, oh, scones, which way around, cream then jam or jam then cream. I'm a jam then cream person because you can spread jam, whereas, and then you just plop like, uh, that sounds really weird, just scoop and like dump it. I don't know how to describe it, but like, you know what I mean? Just put it on top. Whereas like, you can't spread the jam on the cream. You have to spread the jam then the cream, you know? You don't even spread the cream really. Friends is overrated the TV show. No, I don't think so. It has been watched quite a lot. But like, I feel like, I don't know, it's just a good classic. And you should go watch it if you haven't watched it. Because I'm at the, I'm actually watching it now. But I'm watching it with a friend. So like we're doing it like every Friday we'll sit and watch it together. When we have time. Uh, chocolate. Chocolate is gross. No. Who in their right minds would think chocolate is gross? Like, excuse me. Um, yes, I can't have too much of it, otherwise I feel sick. But it's not gross. At all. Mango. <laughs> Mango. <laughs> Mayo. That's what I meant to say. Mayo is better on chips and ketchup. Okay. Everyone's going to hate me. But yes, I agree. I agree so much. Because, well, actually, I don't like ketchup, so you can't really blame me. Uh, I don't even really like mayo that much. I prefer plain chips, which I know people are going to hate me even more. But it's fine. I prefer mayo on chips or no sauce at all. Olives are disgusting. I used to hate them, like, with a passion. I would no, 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 no. Never go near them. But now, I think my mum brought them. For Christmas ones and they were like green olives and they were stuffed with like feta I'm pretty sure yeah feta cheese and it had like other things in it and oh it's amazing I do like normal olives but I prefer stuffed ol olives all social, me social media is fake or dis and disgusting um I don't think it's all fake I think quite a va not va yeah vast majority of it I do think that people do photoshop themselves because they don't like the way they look and they want to be this like petite figure and look a certain way when obviously real bodies way 
way better because you're not editing yourself and putting a fake image that's like because it's just like a knock-on effect you post a photo but it's photoshopped and someone else is going to feel insecure so then i don't know if i'm recording hang on okay <laughs> i thought i wasn't recording jeez i've gone through quite a few and i thought i was gonna have to record the whole thing anyway yeah it's just kind of a knock-on effect so yeah i do i do think quite a lot of it is fake but at the same time i don't think all of it's fake like the photos that i would post they're not fake like yeah because you i don't know i just don't want to be that kind of person that goes oh yeah i'm i'm like this way when i'm no i'm this way you know uh, uh uh children are growing up way too fast nowadays yep for sure i grew up i don't think i grew up too fast i grew up a bit but like that's because i had more responsibilities probably when i was younger that's probably why it made me grow up quicker a bit i was like more mature at a younger age younger age whereas some people they have like phones at like 10 as you know, i can't speak i got a phone at 11 but like they'll get them at like eight or nine and i'm like do you actually need a phone do your friends need a phone should they actually have a phone no i don't think they need a phone and they they use it mainly for games but they also have social media at the like eight nine which i get but I feel like when you're older, it's okay. But I don't know, just eight, nine, ten. Ten's not as bad, but I feel like eleven's fine because then you're in like year six. So yeah. Um. Every time I'm home alone, the house acts funny. Okay, so when I'm home alone, uh, obviously you listen out a lot more. But I don't personally. I don't find the house acts funny. I just, if something falls, then I go and investigate it. But, like, I'm not... That sounds really bad. I'm not to say that I don't really care. But I do just because I don't want my house to be broken in. So, yeah. Um, uh, blah, 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 blah. People are too gullible. Yep, I agree with that. Um, one of my friends is very, very, very gullible. Um, we were talking about something and then we kind of tricked her into thinking one thing. And then she got shocked when she found out what we were actually talking about well what it actually meant i can't remember i think I, it was on d of v i did d of v like oh i don't know when before i broke up for the summer i did d of v uh but yeah i think people are way too gullible these days people are cheap and want too much for they want as in, basically, they, they're too cheap. As in, they want, like, I don't know, Gucci for, like, 100 quid. That's not going to happen, is it? That's what I was trying to say. Uh, yeah, I think it, I'm guilty of that. Hey, I like nice things just on a budget. I don't have a lot of money, and I like my money. I like having money. So, yeah, I like having a lot of stuff for cheap. But, like, good. It's it's good quality making bed in the morning is pointless i disagree with that i think it is a very good point because i feel my bed is currently made i feel a lot more cleaner and i think it just sets you off in the right mood do you know what i mean like you'll get up and i and i get dressed and and i do my bed that's like one of the first things i do in the morning i will make my bed because when i come home I don't know, I feel a little sloppy. Even though there's only one thing, it's like, it just makes, not makes my day, but it helps me stay, not stay motivated, but stay motivated, if you know what I mean, like, yeah. Uh, uh, I don't know how to describe it. I'm mean, <laughs> doing my hands a lot. But yeah, I don't know how to describe it, like, if I come home from school and my bed's unmade, I feel really unproductive. There we go. Job searching can be fun. Yeah, I agree. I like searching for jobs. Like we used to get these quizzes that we would take and it tell us like what job we were best for. Uh, eating. Wait, 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 wait. No, chocolate ice cream is rank. People are not really gonna like me, but I don't particularly like. It's not my favorite, but it. I wouldn't choose like I wouldn't choose to eat chocolate ice cream. Like I, 
I'm really boring and I just prefer vanilla ice cream. So, yeah, I just like, you know, like the, is it what, the mixture, like the strawberry, the chocolate and the vanilla. It's like ne Nepolin, Nepolin. I don't know whether I'm saying that right. <laughs> but yeah, I would only ever, ever, ever do vanilla. I used to like chocolate and strawberry. Then I went off chocolate and strawberry. And now I just like vanilla. Um, uh, eating energy. No, eating every food with ketchup. Again, I said, don't like ketchup. Hate it. I don't like it. The only time I'll eat it, if it's in something and I can't taste it, that's the only time I'll ever eat something with ketchup. Brave, the film, Brave is better than Frozen. Yeah. No, 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 no. Brave is not better than Frozen. The film. Brave, the film. You know, with, like, the ginger hair. So, yeah, I think Frozen is way, way, way better than Brave. Uh, Christmas is overrated. No. Absolutely not. I do think there is a lot of excitement around it, but I don't think it's overrated. I just think it's rated. Not underrated or overrated, it's just rated, you know? <laughs> yeah, I don't I don't think it's overrated at all. If you can laugh alone, you can live happily. Yeah, that means you don't need someone else's happiness to satisfy your happiness. I mean, don't get me wrong, I like other people's happiness, but like I I laugh at myself. So, <laughs> my dad, I don't actually know whether you saw that, but my door's there and he just peeps his head through. Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, where are you? Uh, mm. <laughs> if you can laugh alone, yeah, you can live happy. Uh, I think you can. Yeah, I don't really know. Actually, I laugh. I laugh at, like, YouTube, like, videos I watch, or, like, on TikTok or Netflix. Like, I laugh at that. But then I can also laugh at myself. So I find myself quite funny. So, yeah, maybe I can live alone. Uh, being able to check each other's phones in a relationship should just be loyalty. Like, for, it should be, in, like, a no-negotiation thing. Yeah, I think that's true. I think having an, an open relationship, but having that, like, hmm, having that trust, loyalty in that relationship is really, really key. So, like, if I was with someone or anyone was with someone else, they, like, so, like, a mum and a dad, for example, well, more, yeah, I feel like it was a younger age as well. Actually, no, I don't want to say that because I feel like older people, they can still, like, cheat. But any, okay, any age, you should just be able to look at each other's phone. Go through any messages, any liked photos. Anything. Um, nuts and chocolate is wrong. No, I think there's, like hazelnut chocolate which is very is really really nice like there's a, just it gives it a bit of a kick with it in T tea sucks i don't really like tea used to love it now i don't like it i don't think it sucks like it's okay not my favorite uh hate avocado but love guacamole um i used to love it i went through a stage of having it on avocado avocado having avocado on toast but now i don't really eat it i just have i love guacamole though <gasps> guacamole is the best let me tell you it's amazing like you know there's like four dips you get at tesco's i'd eat like a whole like tub of it it's so bad but so good watermelon is rank not my favorite fruit there are better fruits per in my in my opinion and i know people are gonna hate me because they're like, oh, watermelon's amazing. No. I don't think it is, personally. I would prefer just a normal melon, like cantaloupe or... Ca cantaloupe? Cantaloupe? I don't know how you say it. You know that. Or just, like, melon or anything else. Just, I don't particularly like watermelon. Like, I'll eat it, but... I prefer apple music. No! 
who in their right mind would prefer Apple Music? Like, excuse me, but Spotify's way better. Or YouTube, like if you go on YouTube and you just type in a song, but Spotify's way better for listening music on. What else? Beatles are overrated. Don't really listen to Beatles. I think, yeah, I just don't really listen to them. So don't really have an opinion on them. All types of music is great. Country has to go. I actually love country. Like some country music is amazing. Classical, I hate. I don't know what it is. I just don't like it. Everything else, I like like rap, pop, um, and everything else I like really, really like. Classical is amazing. No way. Uh uh. Not in a million years. Some people, on the other hand, like my dad, loves it. He'll like stick it on the radio and be like, he'll like just do it. And I will moan and moan and moan and moan and moan until he switches it. Or I'll just change the uh, station. So yeah, I really, really don't like classical. Women are morally justified in fearing men. I do think women do have the right to be morally justified to be scared by men because obviously the past, but I don't I don't think you always have to be scared of men. Like, yeah, have your precaution, precautions? Not sure of the word, but you can have your like wits about you. There you go. But I don't, th I do also think you don't always have to be like that once you get to obviously know a person you don't always have to be like as cautious obviously be cautious of everyone but like you know i think i just had a st stuck hiccup a long a long walk on the beach is not an ideal date for every oh okay so i found this one and it was like long um long walks along the beach are not ideal for a first date and should not be on every guy's uh fat thing on the bio on every guy's tinder i agree with that i don't think maybe a first date i mean yeah cool i do love long walks but maybe like a date when you're like together not together but like maybe not the first one maybe like the fourth or the fifth depends on how long you date for but or like when you come girlfriend and girlfriend boyfriend girlfriend or whatever you are like when, when you become in a relationship an interlocked relationship i'm joking i'm joking you no know, when you just get together uh and it'd be quite cute to do like long i love long walks of the beach not even if i'm in a relationship but just generally it's so cool like with friends or with family <gasps> that's it <gasps> i'm done you've probably had enough of me talking and already clicked off this video but if you stay to the end i mean whoa i would not listen to me ramble on for like 20 minutes or however long this video is so yeah i i did a few just a few unpopular opinions cannot speak today don't know what's the matter with me so yeah i hope you enjoyed this video and yeah if you stay to the end you should should we should we make a thing where we do like a comment maybe comment a pineapple if you stay to the end there you go comment pineapple if you stay to the end and also give it a big thumbs up and subscribe and i'll see you next time bye